Hi, this is Reverend K.L. Blessing. There are times in our lives that we encounter a lot of trials, tribulations, false accusations, problems, situations that are beyond us. And as believers, as Christians, sometimes we don't even know how to tackle this problem or even pray about it. And yet still, we may be going through the valley of the shadow of death, we may be going through some storms in our lives. The our world is falling apart. We are going through marital issues, financial problems, health challenges, some problems in our families, even attacks going on in your dreams, in your life, which you can't even explain to people because you will think you are crazy. If you tell them what you are seeing or experiencing in your body or the kind of dreams you are having, they will think that you are going mad, but they have no idea the reality of attacks, witchcraft attacks or voodoo activities you are going through. And sometimes for two, you experience some hindrances, resistance in you trying to get a job, move, it, move ahead, in moving ahead in life. Everything seems to be a standstill. You experience curses. During these times, precious one, uh, sometimes you don't even know what to pray or how to pray about the situation. But we thank God that during this time, the Bible says that when we don't know how to pray, the Holy Spirit himself makes intercession. On our behalf, the Holy Spirit Himself knows your deeper most need and begins to intercede and pray for you and to ask the Lord to grant you His perfect will and uh, uh, your request according to His perfect will. So, during that time, I suggest that as a child of God, you pray in the Holy Spirit. And you ask the Lord to fight for you. You ask the Lord to open the door for you. You ask the Lord Almighty to vindicate you. You ask the Lord to favor you. You ask the Lord to come through for you and save you and rescue you from out of your problem. And you can do so by praying in tongues. So I want to I want you to join me in the next few couple of minutes for us to pray in, in tongues, a tongues of warfare. That whatever problem, whatever challenge, whatever attacks, whatever arrows, whatever spells, whatever shackles, whatever curses has been released against you, against your marriage, against your health, against your family, the Bible says in Isaiah chapter 7 verse 7, it shall not stand, neither shall it come to pass. It shall not stand, neither shall it come to pass. Isaiah chapter 40, 54 verse 17, no weapon that is formed against you and I shall ever prosper in every lips raising up, up against us in judgment that glory. God has given us power to condemn it. God has given us power to trample over scorpions and serpents and over all the powers of darkness and they shall by no means do us any harm. The Bible says they will come against us in one way but they will flee from us in seven ways. The Bible says when the enemy come against us like a flood, the Spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against them. As you pray this prayer, any evil arrow, any satanic arrow, every witchcraft arrow that has been shot against you, it will backfire, it will boomerang, it will go back to the sender. And anybody who is practicing witchcraft against you, their witchcraft over your life, controlling, manipulating, and impacting your life will be destroyed by the fire and the power of God. As you pray in tongues, whatever door that has been shut before you will open by fire, by fire, force in the name of Jesus. Whatever is contending or whatever contention is going on against your destiny, that contention, evil contention, witchcraft contention, demonic contention, which altered contention will be destroyed by the power of the Holy Ghost. So join me right now as we begin to pray in the Holy Ghost. And I believe the Lord God Almighty will begin to bring deliverance to you right now. So right now, just lift up your voice. And if you can pray in tongues, begin to pray in the Holy Ghost. Pray in tongues and let the Spirit of God begin to intercede on your behalf in the mighty name of Jesus. Rebada, <laughs> 
da rika da 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 rifa pa ya da be rifa pa ya da ba rifa pa ya da be rifa pa na ba ba rifa pa ya da be rifa pa ya da ba rifa pa ya da be rifa pa ya da ba rifa pa ya da des rifa pa ya da ba rifa da ba 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 da ba